Hey guys, John here from Bar Lovers, and today, basically, I just mined up this butter and emeralds and this diamond pick, which I really regret using, and I'm going to store it in that chest over there that I just found in this world made of complete butterness. Yeah, so let's go and store it. Wait a second. Whoa! Aww. What the? What the? What the heck? So this here is um my redstoneless death trap. Really, the only redstone is like the gigantic hopper system. It's a gigantic hopper and dropper system. That's literally the only redstone. So yeah, if you're wondering how to make this, and you probably are, I'll show you. So you're going to need carpet. Let me just turn off the texture pack. Going to need carpet, a block of your choice, eh, redstone ore, and then um, sand. Jungle wood, cocoa beans, yeah, cocoa beans, awkward thing, but you actually need it, yep, better get those cocoa beans or else you'll fail, and then you're going to need slabs, alright, let's get to building, so to build this death trap, okay. this is what you do. So it's based off of this glitch where like jungle wood and then this right here and sand. If you break the jungle wood, you have flow and sand and then any block update next to it will cause it to fall. So that's how it works. So basically if you have like this right here with redstone ore next to it, when I make this update, then the sand will fall. That's what the glitch is. That's like this entire thing, that's how it, what it's based off of. So what you do is you put your log like this, then put your sand here. Then you're going to want to do the same on the other side. And then you want to put redstone ore on one specified side, and then your block of choice on that side. Now, just do this. All right. Then you want to put a carpet of your choice on top of the sand. And then carpet from the side of that. And now just break the logs. And now you're done. But not completely done. Now what you want to do is install the trap. So you basically just go down over here. All right. And now, you just, basically, dig a hole. I'll just cut, so I'll see you guys there. Okay, so, when you think you've got a deep enough hole, then you're going to want to place a slab of your choice down at the bottom so the sand will fall and then yeah break and now you can just fill this in and we're done now let's test it let's just test it real quick It almost works. Now I'm just going to kill myself. Oh. Yay! 
Yep, that's how you make it. And um, yeah, it's actually really simple. You don't use wood to make cocoa. I don't know. Cocoa beans. I'm using cocoa beans. And what? Jungle wood. God. That's my sister. Don't worry about her. She's horrible. God, why? Good block. This is for zero. This play. Block of butter. Do two, two and boom. Got my sixty-four blocks of butter. Now just place these. I think it's weird how butter can't mine butter. It's like, what the crap? Why can't butter mine butter? And yeah, and uh. It's not working. Are you in the snapshot version? Press F3, and then look at the top. Okay, so here's another type of block update detector. Do, 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 do. Top left, derp. Stop screaming. So this is the block update detector. See? See, this is a really simple block update detector to create. Alright, and I'm out.